Hey, yeah. Back again to my park. This is a quick view of the cathedral of the park I'm in. Anyway, right, this video is going to explain how the Respect Exchange School works. At the heart of the school are what we call social groups. And obviously this is where uh, children, adults, a mix of both, basically socialise online and face-to-face, -face. so we mix the two. And then we help them socialise by, as I'm saying, that's a ring here if you like, the first outer ring of support is using the traits, which are on the website respectexchange.com, and everyone gets a copy of them here. So these are the good traits, and these are the bad traits. And they're all explained to everybody by the social groups facilitator. So the facilitator's job is to basically enable them to socially interact according to the traits. On top of that, that extra ring out, we also provide one-to-one -one mentoring program. And that is, if you like, if the social group, if there's an issue with it that an individual might have within the social group that is impacting how they socialise and who they are, that the group, or they're not comfortable in letting the group help them deal with, then they can ping out to the one-to-one -one mentoring programme. Okay, and that basically works uh, by, by the individual, individual of the social group sharing on their own private thought wall on respect exchange their, their thoughts. Then or a mentor then comes in and asks them questions about their thoughts to which they then start answering and start to explore more about who they are so they can understand who they are, get a stronger understanding of their self. Okay, so there's basically two levels of support. There's the facilitator with the traits, the mentoring program, which is also governed by the traits. And the idea is, is the group socialise, but they are free, completely free, to choose what it is they want to do, what it is they want to learn. Their core learning resources are each other, the internet, and they have a budget to be able to call in experts that they choose. Right, so they're free to, to, to choose what they want to do. Obviously, we are teaching them how to socialise, so the nine traits is critical. And then go to the mentoring programme if they've got an issue, personal issue that they don't really want to share with people. The idea is they then socialise using the traits and then gradually over time, what they do is they develop a stronger sense of self and then as the stronger sense of self emerges and their complete freedom of what it is they want to do combine for them to start to work out what it is they want to do their sense of self then allows them to start merging each other's skills and capacities to go and do something that they all want to do that they've all chosen to do that will change their lives forever so to just sort of pull back so what we're doing here, to see the bigger drawing if you like. So we have a social group where the socialising happens. So people learn to socialise. The outcome is a stronger sense of self of who they are as an individual. And that stronger sense of self allows them to use the socialising for them to merge each other's skills, knowledge, expertise, capacities, gifts, merge them together so that the group achieves something that will change everybody's lives for the good. And that is the overview of basically how, respect, how the Respect Exchange School works. So we set up social groups and go through that process over varying periods of time so that people leave with a strong sense of self. They know how to achieve. They know how to socialise in a way that maintains their sense of self and their ability to achieve and they have a lot of fun and a lot of laughter. Okay, thanks a lot. Have a great day.